very therapeutic. I just love art so much and this is the way I can do it now without my hands. You have to find things that you love to keep you going. Hi, my name is Alex Piaggi. I'm 38 years old. I'm from Morrison, Colorado, and I have a rare autoimmune neuromuscular disease called C. Isaac I went to college for 3D animation. My dream was to work for Disney or Marvel. I came up two classes short before the disease started. I can't hold a pencil, so I can't draw it anymore. One day, my mom brought home a catalog with a pupil mouth painting, and that's how that, I'm like, whoa, I need to give this a try. Twin Peaks is my first mouth painting. It took about three and a half months to do it because I was learning how to rotate the brush and hold it in my mouth properly and all that. I put it on Facebook and see what people thought, and they were pretty blown away with it, so that gave me a big confidence boost. Before I was diagnosed with CIDP, I played basketball pretty much every day. I used to be able to dunk a basketball. I'm six foot one, so I was pretty athletic. I'm a big fan of LeBron James. He helps out his community tremendously. He's a great role model for kids, so I really look up to him, and I figured I wanted to draw my first portrait, and he was a great inspiration to do that. My good friend, he posted my painting of LeBron James on Reddit and just wanted to see what would happen. And it made it on the first page. It had like 22 or 23,000 upvotes. So from there, I just decided to start posting more on Reddit. I wanted to start spreading awareness about my disease through my art. That's my goal with my art. I painted my rooster for my mom. My mom is my caregiver as well as my dad. I've nearly died six times due to pneumonia and respiratory failures. Uh, so they've had to go through all that hardship. With a disability, you have to have a strong support group around you and you have to have a good sense of humor about it too. I have a website now when I have uh, my prints up for sale and I've made a few sales, which is really neat. And it gave me a big confidence boost for my work moving forward. If you have a disability, learn to adapt so you can do what you love.